If you guys want to be in with a chance of winning this Resurrectionist emblem, simply drop a like on the video and leave a comment. What is going on guys? Today I bring you another Destiny video and today I'm going to show you guys a simple but super effective way of getting the husk of the pit which is real fucking quick and this actually starts off your quest to get in the exotic necro chasm. Now I've been told by many people that to get this uh, husk of the pit you simply have to kill hive and you can do this in numerous ways. You can do it through strikes, through story missions, whatever, whatever, whatever and there's a chance that it will drop. Now that might be the case for other people, but I have been killing Hive all over the fucking place and shit has not been dropping for me. But the way I will show you guys in this video, you will have it in no time at all. So what I did was I started up the Nightfall, which is Tanix this week. At the start you encounter some Shriekers, run past these motherfuckers and then you'll come to a group of Hive enemies, a few Knights, a Wizard and some Thrall. Kill these bitches, then run past this area. You will then come to where I am now in the video. Make sure you shoot the Gatling gun on the wall because this thing wrecks your fucking face. Then approach this room, make your way around this room anti-clockwise. You will notice a few hive enemies here including two ogres and a wizard. Not the easiest to kill but take out the wizard first and any other small minions floating about. Then concentrate on the ogres. I got this first time doing it this way. I also have three other friends who also got it first time doing it this way as well. Just make sure you kill both ogres. If it does not drop for you, either die here to restart the mission, but if you have pushed too far forward, restart the nightfall from orbit. It's as simple as that. And it does drop first time most times. Now once you have the husk of the pit, you are on track to get in the necrochasm. Check the actual husk of the pit's perks to see what your next step is. You can see mine is to kill knights, but yours could be to kill thrall or wizards etc etc. Or you could check the quest tab, seen on screen now. In doing this, it upgrades the weapon to the Edelan ally. Once you've done this, you will have to go and see the speaker in the tower, who in turn sends you to Erismon. Erismon tells you you need to cleanse the weapon by doing the following. Traverse the abyss, which is basically the first part of the Crota's Eng and Raid, the dark room, you run across the bridge at the end. Once you've done this, you then have to defeat Crota and then defeat Omnigo. Once you've achieved these steps, you then have to return to Erismon, who gives you the essence of that Oversoul. You then have to upgrade your Edelon ally and then apply the essence of the Oversoul to the Edelon ally and then you will receive your Necrochasm. It's basically as simple as that. Now I actually don't have the Necrochasm yet as I'm waiting to do the raid with my team tomorrow. But for an in-depth guide on this weapon, check out the video linked in the video description by Arex Gaming. But guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope it helped you get the husk of the pit. Let me know if it does down below in that comment section. Thanks as always though for stopping by. Subscribe if you're new around here. Turn on the notifications so you never miss a video and I'll catch you on that next one. Always in the wrong Knowing where we stand But you and I Will carry on we never get it right